Some vendors are pleased with the outcome of Monday's meeting, like Patricia Shagas. It was overwhelming that finally people are listening to us. And I'm so grateful. And county staff says more dates are possible in the future. As that continues to build and we continue to grow upon that integrity, I think the market will expand. At the last Farmers Market Advisory meeting, the board passed a rewrite of the membership rules of procedure. Here's the old section, here's the new. The committee would expand from five members to seven members. Four of those would be agricultural vendors, three at-large members. At-large can be anyone from the county. Again, they could possibly be vendors, but it could be anyone, anyone that might have an interest in our um, environment, have an interest in agricultural production. The Board of Commissioners passed approval on expanding the advisory committee. Vendors agree more members could help bring more solutions. More conversation can go on in the advisory committee and more suggestions on how we can move the market forward in a positive way. I think that's an excellent idea. I've attended several meetings. But there are mixed opinions on who should be on the committee. The mission of the farmer's market is to sell fresh um, um, vegetables and fruits. So we have food vendors, we have craft vendors, and they, we all need a voice. The county says it is a farmer's market, so preference should be given to those selling produce. The four plus the three at large, uh, really we thought that was the good mix on that board.